Hi everyone, I'm back with another video from the Diablo 3 Season 29 PTR. This time I want to show off the new Oryx Dream. So you might have seen this in the patch notes, they have buffed Oryx Dream a little bit. Uh, they mostly buffed Desolate Sands and Shrouded Moors with more density, which were the two weakest maps of that uh, Greater Rift type. In case you don't know what Oryx Dream is at all, we have a post here so you can go check that out. And in short, it's basically uh, a good Greater Rift that has a 1 in 100 chance to open. It has only a few select maps and it has only a few select monster sets that can appear, which are generally very good. And the problem was that those two in particular were really bad and people very often skipped them, so it wasn't exactly a dream rift. So Blizzard is trying to uh, amend that. And as you can see here, this is the Shrouded Moors, which is yeah, in the, the, best, <laughs> the best map in general now, inside of all extremes at least. Um, this is going to be probably the map to push, even better than Fields of Misery and Festering Woods and all that. And it's a bit smaller, as you can see, but it's really packed. And this is like the so-called empty monster set here, the Dark Berserkers plus Punisher combo, that uh, yeah, usually has like very, very few monsters. And uh, I just wanted to show off like how crazy this can be now. And here's also the follow-up Desolate Sands. Uh, <laughs> that just shows us like the, the next buffed map. And you can see this as well, like, there is a lot more stuff than before. So it's not really that, um, like, empty anymore as it used to be. The problem with this map was it was just, like, so large. And there was, like, like all the monsters were, like, too spread out in, like, all different corners. Because it's, like, by far the largest map. And it just wasn't really a very uh, valuable map to push. So usually we just skip it as much as possible. And you see here another round of Shrouded Moors. This time with an actual good monster type, the Ghost Combo. And you see how packed this is. And I think there can be like six elite packs now in like a Shrouded Moors. I actually went and counted them. And uh, well, this is only sometimes just a little like, you know, straight line or like you know, around one or two corners. And this is the entire map. So it can be pretty crazy like how much stuff you can find here. So whenever you get this in our extreme, you don't have to be, be sad about it anymore. In fact, it's, as I said, probably the best map to push in some cases now because there's simply so much stuff at a very small area. They have also changed which monster sets can be in Oryx Dream, so this is a bit work in progress as far as I can tell, but they are tweaking the monster types that they can find there, so they wanted to like take some out, put some other good ones in, because there was also a common complaint, but uh, yeah, we, we see this here, that um, they wanted to remove Toxic Lurkers and Dark Berserker monster sets, they put in Summoners, Chargers and Lacuni Slashers, uh, and apparently one of the Bogan combos, but we'll see what it will be exactly in the final patch notes. One other interesting change though that they made to Oryx Dream, a little trivia I guess, because it doesn't really have a gameplay impact for the most part, but Oryx Dream used to have always guaranteed 10 floors, and for some reason that's changed now. So you see here I'm in floor 7, and there's the end pattern, so I'm not sure why, but that was kind of like an advantage of Oryx Dream, where I can just like skip floors really quickly and then try to find something else that is really good. And, well, now there might actually be cases where you just don't have many flaws to skip, so you kind of have to play what you get. But, okay, this might not be really such a problem. In any case, that's it for this video here. Just wanted to show off the new Oryx Dream, and I'm going to keep you guys updated with what is actually going to be in the final patch notes and what that means for pushing in the future. That's it. Hope you liked this, and see you guys next time.